So if I'm given this picture and I need to find X and Y, there's a few things I first need to know. One, since all three of these lines are parallel, these two angles in between the two parallel lines cut by a transversal are um, supplementary. They're consecutive into your angles. Same thing with these two. So these two angles here are supplementary. These two sup uh, angles are supplementary. And we'll use that information to solve what we need to get, the X and Y. Um, so for our first equation here, our first equation we need to make, because we're going to solve a system of equations, is knowing that these two angles here are supplementary. I then can state, well, that 5x minus y plus 150 degrees is equal to 180 degrees. Supplementary meaning they add up to be 180 degrees. And now I just want to, I'm going to simplify and just get, uh, subtract that 150 to both sides, and I'm left with 5x minus y equals 30 degrees. Okay, so now I have one equation that I'm going to work with. My second equation, let's do this in green, is the other two that are supplementary. So I have 5x plus y plus 130 is equal to 180 degrees because these two angles are supplementary because they're both consecutive interior angles. Um, we have uh, two parallel lines that are cut by a transversal. And I'm going to simplify it a little more. 5x plus y equals uh, 180 minus 130 is 50 degrees. So now I have two equations, the one in black and one in green. And so there's a few ways you can solve this. You could um, get one variable by itself, so I could maybe get the y by itself, plug it in to this equation. But this, this will be a little easier if we just actually subtract the two equations. This is one of the techniques we can um, solve this system. So I'm going to put the two equations on top of each other. So we found 5x plus y equals 50. And since I see that we have a y value here, um, we have a negative y and a positive y, I'm just going to add these two equations. Okay? And by adding these two equations, we have, well, 30 plus 50 is 80. Negative y plus a positive y is just 0y. We don't have any more. They cancel each other out. And we're left with 10x. So this equation is simplified to be 10x equals 80. And so to get x by itself, x equals 8. So now I am almost there. I got halfway, I'm halfway there. I have x equals 8. And I need to take that equation and plug it back into one of our previous equations that we found to get our y. Since this equation is sitting right here, let's plug it into that one. Um, so we can do five times the value of x that we found, which is eight, plus y equals 50. Five times eight is our 40. Okay, and then we just subtract the 40 both sides and we get y equals 10. So our, um, our two uh, values for x and y would be 8 and 10. Thank you for watching. Uh -huh.